<laughs> what was that? A cough? Someone has a cold. Maybe it's you. Maybe it's everyone. Because if you look at the CDC's map of influenza-like illness right now, so much of the country is in red, dark red, or purple because millions of people have cold and flu symptoms. And a lot of people are out there Googling how to tell if you have RSV, influenza, or COVID. Sorry, amateur disease detectives. It's impossible to tell without getting tested. But I get the curiosity. So here are five considerations to sort through if you're wondering what respiratory virus is plaguing you. Is anyone else sick? Seriously, ask around. Friends, family, workplace, your gym squad. Someone may have had a COVID exposure or a boyfriend who has the flu or a kid who's home because RSV is ravaging their daycare you might find some hints. Someone's individual risk may change the urgency to test. RSV, for example, is more severe in younger kids and those with underlying medical issues. And the majority of severe illness and deaths in COVID-19 are now occurring in an older population. Flu symptoms tend to come on the fastest. COVID-19's incubation period is two to 14 days. RSV is about five days. Influenza is one to four. So if you're around someone who's sick and then the next day you're not feeling that great, Place your bets on influenza. There might be some context clues in the symptoms. COVID-19, loss of taste and smell. RSV, wheezing in young children. Influenza and COVID-19, more likely to cause body aches. But these are just generalizations. Viruses are really annoying and they kind of like to break rules, so you can't 100% rely on any of this. So in the end, you can't really internet sleuth your way into knowing exactly what respiratory virus you have. And you may actually have to go and get tested if you or a loved one are high risk or if your symptoms are getting worse. And remember, keep emergency departments for emergencies like respiratory distress. Everything else can be managed at home or through a clinic. And please stay home if you're sick. Happy holidays, everyone.